Yo, what's good, guys? Um, so we're gonna be lowering my truck a little bit more from the front. I'll be lowering it from the back a little bit more, but I'll be later on because I still have to order the the lowering blocks. But um, let me show you how the truck sits right now. It's a little bit dirty, but let me show you guys how it sits, and let me tell you tell you guys why I wanna lower it more. So, yeah. so this is how the truck sits currently. Yeah, I don't know if you guys could notice, but it's like an inch higher in the front. And, um, you know, I could tell. And let me show you guys. So I want to go an inch or half an inch lower up front. You can see the little gap, like an inch gap. So, yeah. I had bought these springs last year when I was uh, figuring out what drop I want to go. And I had them for a while, but, and they were right good, but the only thing I didn't like is that they were not what the ad said. The ad said these were supposed to make me go lower like 3.5 inches, but they actually went lower. They actually went lower a lot more than that. So it was messing up my wheel well. So what I heard was about some um, spring helpers that they were supposed to um, go up like an inch so I bought them so I'm gonna put them on these and see what how it looks if it looks too tall then good thing these were cheap so I could cut these a little bit and um, and if I don't like it then I'll just go back to what I was I am right now but um yeah let me put these on real quick I'll, sh I'll so you got, I'll, I'll record it so you can see, you know, how fast forward, like real fast, so it won't be so boring. But yeah. All right, guys, well, these are the spring helpers that go on the springs. Supposed to lift like an inch. So what you do is you put them, you know, through here. I need the, I need to, uh, I need the ratchet for it, but when you do it, you put them through there and it's supposed to lift a one inch. So I think that's gonna be perfect. But um, there's only one way to find out, so we're gonna install them. Uh, what sucks about all this is that I'm gonna have to get an alignment again. And I just got an alignment not too long ago, so. I practically just threw that money away, but I mean, that's what happens when you want to look good, you know what I mean? When you want your truck to look good. So, fuck it. Fuck it. Oh. The helper's go. All right, guys, well, I mean, I lowered it already, but uh, I think it's way too low. You can see it's, it went low like two inches. Barely any wheel gap. And uh, yeah, I don't think that's what I want. So I'm gonna put the other ones back in. Actually, I'm thinking about maybe cutting very little on those. On those. But I don't know, I'm gonna think about it. All right, guys, well. I ended up cutting it very little. You can see right here. And just to put everything back together. Oh, and I did put the the leaf, the leaf helper there too, because without them, it was sitting way too uh, low. And they lifted up with those, it lifted up like an inch, 
and a half. So I'm pretty sure I cut like half an inch and that's what I wanted. I wanted to go lower at least half an inch. So let me put let me put everything back and show you guys how it looks, how it sits. I ended up cutting them like I said and it did go lower how I wanted it I still want to go lower but on these trucks when you go way too low the tires you know they, they get a little camper and I was going through tires a lot so I'm gonna be ordering some uh, adjustable control arms soon just not right now because it costs you know money and uh, right now I'm not trying to spend so much money on my truck, you know, because I still got to paint it and, and, you know, do a couple of things to it. But, um, yeah, you know, let me show you guys how it looks. You guys will probably not tell the difference, but, I mean, in person you, you, you'll tell, in person you could tell. So let me show you guys. So that's how it's sitting right now. Like I said, my truck's kind of dirty, so I still have to wash it, but... That's how it's sitting right now. A little gap, which is okay because you don't want to mess up your shit when you uh, hit the bumps. All right, guys, so I guess that's, that's gonna be a wrap up for this video. Uh, make sure you guys like and, and subscribe to the channel. I'm going to be uh, collaborating with a couple of upcoming YouTubers around here. Um, I'm going to be collaborating with my homie Tacho. He just started his YouTube channel. He has a single cap. Um, I put his uh, YouTube channel name down here so you guys can go subscribe to his channel. He, uh, he, has, he works in a muffler shop that his dad owns. And um, he does a lot of he's gonna be doing a lot of videos about uh, exhaust systems and stuff like that you know he's the one that does my exhaust system for my cars and my truck so you gotta make sure y'all go subscribe to him and to my other homie cesar uh he's been doing uh youtube videos for a while but he stopped but now he's gonna continue doing them about his single cop single cab uh Silverado. uh that's a little project he's doing right now he's gonna turbo that truck so y'all make sure y'all go subscribe to this channel too if you guys want I'm also going to put his information down here. So, um, yeah, stay tuned because we're going to be doing a lot of a lot of videos about going to Mexico and, you know, just fun truck stuff. If that's what you guys are into. And I'm still going to be doing, like, you know, like installations of, of my truck and stuff like that and my homies' trucks and, and their cars and stuff. So... So yeah, so I hope you guys could uh, subscribe to the channel, you know, to support and give me some motivation to make more videos like these and, and you know, and to keep practicing because, you know, I'm still a little camera shy. I don't like recording when I'm around people and shit, so, but I mean, I'll get used to it. I know I will, so yeah, make sure y'all subscribe, subscribe to the channel, you know, subscribe because a lot of dope shit is gonna be coming to the channel 
And uh, pretty soon I'm gonna paint my truck because it does need some paint. I mean, the paint's still good, but you know I, I gotta paint the roof as you guys could see. And there's a little a lot of rock chips in the in the front, like in the bumper and the fenders and the hood. And um, you know I still I, I want to paint it. You know, maybe not all of it, but maybe just the parts that it needs to be being painted because my truck's you know the paint's still good. And um, I'm also thinking about getting a different hood, but I'm thinking about it, I don't know, cause it, it is kind of pricey, but I do want it. So I might just pull the trigger and, and buy it. So yeah. All right guys, well, thanks for watching. And like I said, subscribe to the channel, show support. All right, peace.